covered situation. You know those silver bags things? everywhere. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I put those. I can't even start this vlog properly because there's noise on the washing I took my charge and lead up. Hi guys and welcome to our going to Zimbabwe vlog. You do food Zimbabwe. So we are currently yeah, um, packing. Nice. We are packing. Oh, actually, there are bags everywhere. So let me say hello. Hello, 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 hello. Please say hello. True, Coco. So yeah. There's Mr. Zuruvi again, and mm. this is the right. situation. Uh, you sure it is current? Okay. Can I hear the concrete? current current situation? Uh, yeah. Anyone say hello. Hello. Magani, magani, gumati, mana ose nika. Kuri se se, muri seiko, moroi. Oh, I'm so sad to be saying bye to my baby. My baby. This is my youngest. Our youngest. How do you feel about mom and dad going to the house? Yes. Wow. Well, uh, we'll be back soon. We'll be back yeah, you'll be back soon. Yeah. Uh, good goodies. Let's see. Can I? You have good one? goodies. Huh? I think another one. Right. And then this is deputy parent number one. How do you feel about mom and mother going to Zimbabwe? No. No. This is what she's like. She's refusing me to be great on YouTube. <laughs> right. So yeah. So this is us guys last minute.com packing it's not last minute we've been packing for a while but my kilos so not my kilos including building things so trying to even everything out and um, but yeah that is our situation so yeah welcome to the vlog the Zimbabwe and going to Zimbabwe vlog. People, we are leaving. That's all I want to do. Okay. And then we are leaving you in very capable hands. So let's just rewind for a moment and let us introduce ourselves to you. So we are the Tandis and this is our YouTube channel, The Tandis Living the Good Life. So if you're a new subscriber, welcome to the community and if you're a returning subscriber thank you so much for your support it means a lot every comment every like every share we see it and we see you okay so we are a diasporan couple that have lived in the uk for over 20 years and we are planning and prodding our exodus so we're taking you on a journey to show you how that might look like if you're also thinking of doing the same. So this was in 2019 when I last saw the house. And then fast forward to 2024. This is where we are at, guys. I'm so excited to show you where we are. If you've seen all our previous episodes, then you know where we have started this journey from. Tabakure, guys. So... We are just here to inspire other diasporians who think this is impossible. It's possible. My brother, my sister, if we can do it, you can do it too. So here we are being the typical African parents advising our children before we go. <laughs> then don't do what I wouldn't do. The fact that we are not here does not give you the freedom to do what you want to do and come back in the house whenever you want to go. Okay? If I call you for any other reason, I want you to pick up. Unless if you're in car. You're going to be on holiday soon. This thing of you going to meet your friends, you still have to ask us first. We still have to know where you are. Where you are? Okay? Wow. Nothing changes. Because that we are not going to be here, nothing really changes. Same respects, same thing. Mama Yufa, if she can take you somewhere, 
ask her if she can't she will not if you need money for anything whatsapp me i can do it from there okay mm -hmm. nice one i want you to be good as you've been all year all this time be my good kid and i love you all okay mm -hmm. mom got something to say Ah, this was the hardest goodbye, leaving the children behind. They have so much love for Zimbabwe and Africa, and they really want to come. Um, but it's very expensive. And also, as you can tell, they were in school. So when the children are in school, the tickets are less expensive. So Zuruvi gifted me with a ticket to go home back in Christmas 2023. I was so excited, I don't want to lie, because I haven't been home since 2019. So our family friend, Mr. Mwesigwa, took us to the airport. We uh, got our flight at London Heathrow, and we used Ethiopian Airlines. My hope, my prayer, is that one day Zimbabwe, uh, Air Zimbabwe takes to the skies again. So we were very tired. This flight was long, 16 plus hours. But we got an energy boost when we saw that we were now in Zimbabwean airspace. <laughs> It was so exciting to be back on Zimbabwean soil after so many years, since 2019. And you can just tell that the atmosphere has shifted. You feel like a weight has been removed off your shoulders. You are home. And it was so exciting to be greeted by family. We were home. And look at the red machine. Look at our Toyota Hilux. I haven't been in this truck for a long, long time. It was lovely to be home. It was lovely to be taking in the smell, the sounds, the whole atmosphere, the heat. We were home. Just listen to the sounds of home. So this was us passing through Mbari. Mbari is a very busy place, a busy hub. A lot happens there. It's a very industrious place. So thank you so much for watching this vlog. I'm looking forward to showing you what we accomplished on this trip. Uh, thank you so much for liking, commenting and sharing our video and subscribing to our channel, The Tandis Living the Good Life. I shall see you in the next episode. Goodbye.